Mariah is starting off this hour in Harrisburg, Pennsylvania. Hi, Mariah. How are you? I'm good, Dave. How are you? Thanks for taking my call. Sure. What's up? So, uh, one thing that I really want to celebrate is I paid off my student loans um, two days ago. Yay! So, <laughs> yeah, that's one big milestone in my life. And I still have some debt left. I still have a car loan. And my parents have been gracious enough towards me that they've allowed me to stay at home with them so you know, they can uh, allow me to pay off my debt. So they've been really gracious with me with that. <laughs> so uh, both my parents know how determined I am to pay off my car loan, too. And um, I have left as, like, that's what I have left. So uh, I'll make it short for you. Um, so... Uh, it's only fair to them that I help them with utilities and electric since I'm still living at home. And me and my mother have come to that agreement, and that's perfectly acceptable because I'm still living under their roof. Um, one thing I'm not comfortable with is that um, she wants to charge me rent, which is fair, but the, the stipend is that she will hold on to that money for me in her savings account. And she won't let me put that in my savings account. So I feel like there's a trust issue there, per se. Like, she doesn't trust me with my own money. And she wants to help me out in a sense of saving it for the future. But How old are I'm you? Grown ad- I'm 27 years old. 27. Hmm. What yep. do you make a year? I make about 30 grand working two jobs. So I work 40 hours a week at my other job, and I put in about 20 hours with my part-time job. So, hmm. You know, I, Maria, I, I, learning at your 27, you know, my I, I'm, I'm kind of split. So let me say this on the flip side. My father did, did the exact same thing that your mother is doing, um, mm-hmm. uh, but I was 20. You know, I was 19, 20, maybe 21 around that time. Um, he mm-hmm. actually... I, tr- I paid him $250 a month. And by the time I moved out, he actually gave that all back to me and some uh, to start my life off. But let me ask you a question. I want you to be honest with us. Should your mom be able to trust you? Like, are you being a good steward with your money? I am, yeah. She wants to play a game where she's the landlord. And at the end of the game, she gives me all that money from the, the base rent that I've I, saved up over and I don't know, think that's the day a, that I've moved out. So Ma- Maria, I think you got to look at that differently. That's not a game. That's I think that's your mother trying to help you become a young adult. And mm-hmm. if you've never paid rent before, you you do need to know how to do that. So I, I would definitely mm-hmm. take the word game out of your, out of your out of your head and say, okay, cool. Let me just pay my mom rent, move on about your life, get out of debt, and do everything. Um, Mm -hmm. and then just accept the fact that your mom is just trying to help you mature, help you get ready for real life. Uh, Because I'm pretty sure her Mm -hmm. rent is nowhere near (laughs) what rent is actually going to be. But I would definitely say eventually uh, I would try. Honestly, if I was you and Dave may disagree with this, but at 27, I'm I'm looking at how do I get out of the house, even if I do have some debt on the table. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you need to be gone. You need to be gone in three months. Okay. I didn't know if it would Time be to move out, kiddo. Just... Okay. Stop time to move out. Thank you for taking my call. <laughs> you're, 20, you're 27 years old. It's time to move out. Yep. <laughs> get, get your job working. Get get your budget on an apartment. Figure out how it's going to work. Mm-hmm. Take Tell mom I got about three months to get my act together the rest of the way. And um, uh, it's time for you to move out. You're, you're, uh, th- this is emotionally treating someone like they're 18, 17, 19 years old or whatever, and you're 27. Yeah. Okay, so yeah, you need to move on, and uh, your mom's trying to be sweet. She's be trying to be helpful, but it's time for you to take that next big girl step, yeah. and uh, it'll change your life. It'll be good for you. 